Mike D'Antoni has stepped down as head coach of the New York Knicks and will be replaced by Isaiah Thomas. No, I'm just kidding. Isaiah Thomas ain't coming back. But Mike D'Antoni, he's gone. Hey guys, it's your girl Nanny. Thanks for tuning into Sports Nation. News has just dropped that Mike D'Antoni, head coach of the New York Knicks, has stepped down. And this is a huge story in the NBA world considering all that's happened to the New York Knicks in the last month. Okay, Carmelo gets hurt. Oh no, the Knicks are crap. What's going on? Jeremy Lin to the rescue, eight and one with Carmelo out of the lineup. He sa- Jeremy Lin saves the day, brings them back to salvation. Carmelo comes back. They go two and eight. They stink it up. They've lost six in a row. Right now, they're ninth in the Eastern Conference. The Bucks are ahead of them. Something is not right. And today, it just dropped. Mike D'Antoni has decided to part ways with the organization. What are your thoughts? Do you think it was right for Mike D'Antoni to step down? A lot of Knicks fans are saying, you know, Carmelo Anthony should have gone because end of the day, he came back and he's not helping the team. But let's be realistic. Carmelo Anthony is the best player on that team. And I do think it's a reflection on the coach. How can you not win when you have a core of Carmelo Anthony, Amari Stoudemire, Tyson Chandler, Jeremy Lin, and Landry Fields? Like, something is not right. And we all know that Dan Tony doesn't coach defense. He doesn't know how to do it. He's de- he did it down in Phoenix, and he's now doing it back in New York. So I do think it was the right decision for New York to park, way- part ways with Dan Tony. Mike Woodson, former coach of Atlanta Hawks, who is now the assistant for the Knicks, has taken over and is the interim coach. Hit me up. Dan Tony's gone. New York's going crazy. What are your thoughts? See ya.